Hello everyone! I'm Teacher Faye and welcome to our math class. For today's topic, we will talk about basic geometric figure. But before that, let us determine what is a geometry. Geometry is a branch of mathematics concerned with the properties of space and of the figure in space. Geometry, it deals with points, lines, and plane. So first, we will talk about points. What is a point? What is a point? Point is a geometric object having no dimension and no property other than its location. A point is a particular place or position where something is happening. Try to look at the following point. So, point can be a part of a line. Or end of the line and also a corner of a square it can be a center of a circle point is usually named with a capital letter so we have point A B C D E F and G. So this time, we will talk about line. What is a line? Let us go back with the two given points, point A and point E. So if we're going to connect point A and point E, we will have line AE. But technically, it is not line. It is not a line. So it is line segment. So line segment AE. So what is the difference between line and line segment? Okay, what is a line segment? Line segment has beginning and end. So, if we're going to connect the two points, we will have now a line segment. So, what is a line? Line is keeping keep on going endlessly in both direction so using this line segment if we're going to extend both sides of the given point we will have now a line so if we're going to extend the two and point and put an arrow head at the end of them we will have now a line arrow head it represents the infinite direction or endless direction so this time we will talk about the combination of line segment line 
So the combination of line segment and line is we call it we call it ray. What is a ray? One end point and an arrowhead on the other side. So again, we will use this given line segment and then if we're going to extend one side of it and put an arrowhead at the end of it so we will have now ray look at this set of illustrations let us name the three set of illustrations so we have line segment ab line ad and ray em so instead of writing line segment ab we can write a, B, and on top of it, you will draw a line segment. And also the same with line C, D. So instead of writing line or word line, you just write the letter C, D, and put a line on top of the letter. Then and also lines uh, array EF. So again, write the letter EF and then put a la array on top of it. Plane is another geometrical figure. So plane can be represent as top of a table, a wall, and a floor. So, plane is a two-dimensional object. Two-dimensional object, it represents the top and bottom, right and left. So, what is a plane? Plane is represented by any flat surface and extend indefinitely in all directions. As you can see, in this given point below, so they are lie on the same plane. I hope you learned a lot in our lesson. See you on our next lesson in mathematics. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, comment, and share this video. Once again, I'm Teacher Faye. Thanks for watching.